Amen. 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 here in public well I may have not fulfilled my duties as your dad please forgive me forgive me forgive me take this opportunity to thank her family for being there for her when I myself was absent. You, you were then at Ngara Girls and came in school uniform. When I saw you, I saw myself and we spoke at length about your education. You later changed schools and went to Aria Girls, then McKinney School, where you did your own levels. Thereafter, you joined St. Christopher's for A levels, and then you agreed to join this university for your undergraduate degree. From where you graduated with a degree in mass communications. We took a very beautiful photo on your graduation day which I shall always treasure. And then, and thereafter, got your job at the Kenya Broadcasting Corporation. From the time I accepted you as my daughter, I never stopped paying for your education and supporting you in other ways. And I remember, after the graduation ceremony which I attended in 2008, you told me that you are very grateful that I've been by your side in your educational journey. I would also support you from different parts of the world in many ways, especially when I was in London and Nigeria. You later told me you wanted to do postgraduate studies in international relations at the United States International University. And I did not hesitate to pay for your studies. Later you joined Alliance Francaise to study French and I remember on one occasion you told me there was a trip to France and I paid for you. The following year you went again to France as you told me you loved the country very much. My only fear was that this would be a normal event and I would have to be funding the journey. And you told me, don't worry. 
if it's too much for you, I'll become a French citizen. You told me from your visit, you had bought lots of presents for your family and friends to appreciate them always being there for you.